Do you have any idea about the killer's identity? Hmm. The crime was committed by a man of medium height, with red hair and suspicious eyes. He has a slight limp on the right foot and a wart just below his shoulder blade. Poirot! Mon ami, what do you want? You fix upon me a look of dog-like devotion and demand of me a pronouncement à la Sherlock Holmes. Now for the truth. I do not know what the murderer looks like, nor where he lives, nor how to set hands upon him. What shall we do, then? Nothing. Nothing? Do not be so impatient, Hastings. The killer will manifest himself soon enough. I thought I heard the postman. Maybe there's some news. I would go and see. Dear Mr. Poirot, well, what do you think? I believe that I won this round. The end of our affair went like clockwork, don't you feel? But the fun has only just started. I would like to draw your attention to Bexil on Sea on the 25th of this month. We're having a crazy time. Best wishes, ABC. The next crime will be in Bexhill. We must warn Jap to Scotland Yard. Did the letter indicate anything that might help the police? To be honest, I think we can already guess something about the next victim. But I need to think about it a little more. Daily Flicker, June the 22nd, 1935. Battle over control of bank system. What will the government do for money? Andover, murder of a tobacconist. Ah, some cool air. It's impossible to get through to Scotland Yard. Andover, Hampshire, population 31,200 inhabitants. Dear Mr. Poirot, well, what do you think? I believe that I won this round. 
The end of her affair went like clockwork, don't you feel? But the fun has only just started. I would like to draw your attention to Bexilon Sea on the 25th of this month. We're having a crazy time. Best wishes, ABC. Let us examine this more closely. Certain characters in the two letters may have similar defects. Yes, this eye is weird. Yes, this eye is weird. Right. Let right. Let us compare this with the other letter. Yes, the eye characters in the two letters do indeed have the same defects. I have to find some other similar defects to confirm my theory. Yes, the A appears to be quite unusual. Let us examine the characters in this word. Yes, the A appears... Right, let us compare this. That's right, the A characters in the two letters do indeed have the same defects. I have to find some other similar defects to confirm my theory. Hmm, the W is not printed properly. Right, let us compare this with the other letter. Nothing to report for the... Of course, the W characters in the two letters do indeed have the same defects. My theory was right. These two letters were written with the same typewriter. Both letters were written on the same typewriter and show the same characteristics. You surprise me, Poirot. You usually ignore material proof. But there is nothing usual about these case things. Nothing must be overlooked. Let us now try and get our brain cells to work. So, Poirot, have you found something? Oui, I believe so. But I am afraid it is not enough to stop the murderer. Let us go and see Chief Inspector Chap. I will explain there.
to Scotland Yard, please. Jap has invested a great deal in his career. Jap is an investigator greatly respected by his peers. London. I really like this city. One thing is certain, you never get bored here. Alice Asher was murdered in Endover, the ABC killer's first murder. Jap appears to be snowed under. Jap appears to already be overloaded with work. My news is not going to improve matters. Bonjour, Chief Inspector. I am afraid we have some bad news. I have just received another letter signed ABC. The next crime will be on the 25th in Bexilancy. Are you completely sure it's from the same person? I have compared the two letters. There is no doubt about it. I suppose you think he's going to carry out his threats. I fear so. Good God, Poirot. Bexhill is very busy at this time of year, and we have no idea who the next victim will be. I suspect that the name of the second victim will start with B. What on earth makes you think such a thing? I thought about it when I saw the name Asher clearly written of the shop door of the unfortunate woman who was murdered in Andover last month. When I received the letter mentioned in Bexhill, I deduced that the victim, like the town, might have been chosen by alphabetical order. So, it's an alphabet fiend. I'm going to have a list drawn up of all the people whose name starts with B. I hope there aren't too many of them. Bien, we should leave you to work, Chief Inspector. You have a few days to prepare yourself. Thank you for coming, my friends. Poirot? Chief Inspector Jap, your call does not bode well. Indeed, we have just found the body of a young woman on the beach in Bexhill. An ABC was placed on the body. We'll be there as soon as possible. 